In this video, I'm going to show you how you can customize your own SharePoint site to have your own color theme. First, navigate to your SharePoint site, and we can see what existing color themes already exist by clicking on the cog across the top right -hand corner, then click on change the look. And under theme, this is where you'll see all the existing SharePoint themes. Now we can add our own custom color theme into this using PowerShell. So the next thing you need to do is make sure that you've got the SharePoint Online Management Shell installed. Now you can do this by going to Google and just typing in SharePoint Online Management Shell and then going to this web page, clicking on download and installing uh, SharePoint Online Management Shell. The next thing you'll need to do is go to the Fluent UI uh, web page to generate the theme. So by going to this web page, I'm going to Theme Generator, you'll be able to find that we can actually enter in our own hex code um, to generate our color theme. So I'm just going to type in here a hex code for a color that I want, which is my midnight green color. Then when I scroll down to the bottom right hand side, you can see these are the PowerShell um, suggestions of, of what this green color will use. So this color palette up here. Now I can choose to manually tweak this if I want to do, but just for this short demonstration, I'm actually just going to copy all of this right click copy you'll then need to use this powershell script so the first thing we're going to do is paste in here and override these colors so this is going to give us the colors we're going to need for our color palette the next thing we need to do is update the name so we're going to change the name of this so i'm going to call this my midnight green theme and the final thing we'll need to do in the script is update the SharePoint administration URL for when we're signing in. Now, the SharePoint admin URL will always be the first bit before the dot of your SharePoint URL. So mine here is task M, so I'm just going to copy that out and go back into my notepad where I've got my script. I'm just going to change this update here, click on paste. Now I've got my PowerShell ready to go. I'm going to copy all of this and I'm going to open up on my computer my SharePoint online management shell. Now I'm click on the Windows key and this is just going to happen on my other monitor. But I can click on the Windows key, type in SharePoint online management shell and that's going to open up my SharePoint management screen. So I'll drag this over onto this screen. Now all I need to do is paste in my um, PowerShell script. It's now going to ask me to log in. So I'm just going to enter my credentials oops just going on microsoft.com to my test account type in my password and now because i've got mfa enabled it's going to ask me to log in So I'm just getting my MFA text coming through now. And now that will then run my PowerShell script automatically for me and it's now complete. So now if I go back to my SharePoint site, so on the right hand side, I'm gonna click on the cog again, click on change the look. And then under theme, I'm gonna scroll down just going to refresh the site because it wasn't appearing. So I click on change the look, click on theme, and now we've got company themes. So I click on midnight green, click on save, and that's then added my theme to my page. Now um, you can use the variance of the color. So by default out of the box, this is just a very simplistic demonstration to show you how you can get your primary color in but you'll get your primary color along with a subtle variant of it like this light green and it'll also give you a light gray color that will pair with this nicely as well so that was just a simplistic demonstration of how you can use powershell to customize your sharepoint color theme uh, using the primary color of your brand